So I really disconnected from the grid and plugged my EV in instead. I'm sure you've got questions. Hey, there's a guy here trying to power his house from his EV. When he wants to go for a flat white in the morning, he'll end up with a flat battery instead. That saved me a few questions in the comments. But what is reality like? So I have solar that powers my house during the day and also powers my home batteries and my car batteries. Some days there's enough power and some days I need a little extra backup. And that's where the EV comes in. So normally I prioritize my house batteries and only when they're fully charged do I start to charge my EVs. But vehicle to load has given me more energy security. So at 9.54 a.m. I plugged in my EV with the aim of charging it to 100%. About two hours later I checked and the water cat, which is what the car is called, was fully charged. Car unplugged, I waited for the house batteries to start charging. But almost straight away it clouded over and threatened rain. There was enough power coming through the clouds to run the house, but not enough to recharge the house batteries at the same time. At 6pm it was starting to get dark, so I plugged in vehicle to load from my EV and powered the house until about 9.30pm. At which point the house was shut down for the night on minimum load and there was sufficient power in the house batteries to see me through to morning. And I'd only used 3% of the car batteries. In the morning I charged the house batteries to 80% then charged the water cat back to 100%.